Good morning, boys and girls. I thought I'd give you a quick update here from the southern wing of the Stink Bug Works. I have just shot a base coat of white on this main hall from about, oh, somewhere in here back. And <clears throat> this will be the base coat for the color coat. Today, I have some running around to do, but today I'll try to shoot base coats on all the other little parts that make up this hull. One of my viewers asked me, what hull is it? This is the MHZ Miss Madison, not Miss Madison, I'm sorry, Miss Exide. The Miss Madison looks very similar to this, only smaller. This is the Miss Exide. They have since renamed this boat and now just refer to it as the 25-inch hydroplane. So if you go to MHZ, I'll leave a link. If you go to MHZ and look for the 25-inch hydroplane, you will find this. It comes with the hull, the canopy, and the vertical fins. Making a wing is a no-brainer, you know, so they'll leave that up to you. So, what I did, what I did, you know, just for all my painting buddies and people that want to know, I sprayed a real light tack coat, you know, kind of concentrating from here back, sprayed a real light tack coat, and then a little bit heavier base coat. I don't want to pour on weight, so I don't want to flow on a bunch of paint. And in fact, I got very little paint up in these forward areas. In fact, it's it feels, you know how when you spray paint on and it's dry before it hits and it feels kind of dusty? Well, yeah, there's some of that happening right here. Um, this is going to get more coats of blue on it. I'll knock that down um, in the painting process and so forth. So I am ready to shoot the color coat, the white base coat over this. Now, I kind of knocked the surface dust off already, but I'm going to let this thing dry for a good good period of time, probably a week or so, at least a week or so, to get it good and dry. I'll hit it one more time with, uh, what am I using here? I'm using 1,000 grit. So I'll hit it one more time with 1,000 grit before I um, shoot the final color coat on there. And then... Then it's going to be planning out the red stripes. And as if, if you recall from my pictures, there'll be one red stripe that follows this inside plane. So it'll be a red stripe here. And then the word American will go here. And so I'll have to figure out where the edge of the other red stripe is. I need enough red stripe for the word spirit and then I need a white space and a red stripe so you, you see what I'm up against it's not insurmountable but it's just going to be a bit of figuring and tediousness and measuring but that's part of the point of getting a bitchin looking model I mean right now it looks pretty cool but it's plain and white it looks very plain so anyway I thought I'd just give you a quick update on the MHZ 25-inch hydroplane, formerly the MHZ Miss Exide. So until next time, boys and girls, jet out.